Bobby Bones. Hey, y'all. Brothers and sisters. So, love to get messages every single day, and some of them really punch me right in the old heart. And so this is one, and it's not even sad, but it's a mom who wrote for her daughter, who's a huge fan of the show. And so her name is Mindy. That's the mom. The daughter is Taylor. And so I'm going to call Mindy right now about Taylor. Hello? Mindy? No, this is Taylor. Taylor, how are you? I'm doing good. Who's this? This is Bobby Bones. I swear to you, it's Bobby Bones. I promise you. Oh my God, are you serious? I am serious. How are you? (laughs) (laughs) Oh my God, I'm doing good. How are you? I'm great. Okay, so is Mindy your mom? Yeah, Mindy's my mom. Okay, so can I read to you something that she sent me about you? Do you know about it already? I know not, I don't know what is going on right now. Okay, okay, okay. Here is the note that your mom sent me, okay? Okay. It says, Greetings. I wanted to extend a huge thank you, even though we've never spoken a word. You have impacted my family more than you will ever understand. When my daughter was in sixth grade, that's you, she came yes. home upset because she was being picked on at school. I remember that. Very, very, very well. Then what happened? I kind of stood out a little bit. I mean, she told me, hey, you should listen to this guy named Bobby Bones because I had a huge radio in my room. I was like, okay, whatever. And then kind of got super hooked. <laughs> so she said that, you know, like a lot of 13-year-olds, like myself, you were picked on a lot, as was I, and that you listened to the show, and now you're wanting to do radio, and you're kind of doing radio now. Yeah, I mean, I'm doing... I know. Um, I just got an internship about three or four months ago, and I can give it all to you. Like, but every time someone says something, I'm like, yeah, do you listen to Bobby Bones? <laughs> well, you shouldn't and give I- it to me. That That's awesome. But here's what I want to do, because your mom sent me this note talking about how much that you listened to the show and it helped you and how good you're doing now, is that right. I, would, I would like to pay to fly you out here to Nashville and... Let you put you in a hotel and let you come hang out on the show for a day and just kind of sit around and meet everybody and kind of see how we do things here. Oh my God, are you serious? I mean, you have to want to do it, but I'll pay. I'll pay for it. I'll pay for the flight and the hotel. You have to pay for nothing, and you just come and hang out with us and you know learn bad radio habits. Are you laughing or crying, Taylor? I'm crying. <laughs> so, do you want to do it? I don't know if you're this is good or bad. <laughs> oh my god, I'm scared. I'm about to like cry like a baby. So, are you serious? I'm serious. Yes, and you know, I get a lot of letters and emails and messages and. Uh, this one really struck a nerve with me, and your mom's really proud of you. And you know, if you're working hard, and if if I had any influence at all, I think that's awesome. And I would just love to bring you out here and let you hang out and and see what's happening, and and, and watch our show. And maybe you can use that to make your own show. Oh my god! Okay. Oh my God. So that is a for sure yes. I feel like I proposed to you and you never said yes. You just <laughs> cried the whole time. <laughs> yes. I just cried. Okay. No, seriously, that's a yes. Definitely. Just, I'm, uh, I'm, I will do anything for that. You okay. know, that's crazy. Oh, my God. You just made my whole entire year. Oh, well, I mean, the year just started. So, I mean, that's... <laughs> Okay, Taylor, I will talk to you soon. I will see you soon. Awesome. Okay, thank you so much. All right, I'll talk to you soon. Okay, bye. All right, bye-bye. That went well. (laughs) 